Hello, uh, this video is going to be a tag of um, from some of the videos that are already on YouTube right now uh, with what is in my purse right now. I thought this was kind of a fun idea and, and I carry a huge bag to work every day so it might be fun to share what I have and um, I guess we'll get started so I can get this uh, tell you what, what's in my bag in under 10 minutes because there's a lot of stuff in here. Um, so I'm carrying right now, I, I use two bags, um, I kind of alternate, but right now this one I'm using the Longchamp bag in the navy blue. Um, it's a medium sized one so it's really really light canvas, um, built really well and it matches with anything and also it, the, I got the long strap one so it's easier to carry um, all my stuff to and from work. And I got mine in Paris when I traveled, when I was traveling there when I graduated. So it's, it's kind of like a sentimental value and, and I really love it. So, and it's so light, the bag itself is so light. So it doesn't matter if I'm carrying a lot of stuff inside. It always feels like it's, I'm not carrying as much, which is nice. And um, yeah, so I guess we'll get started with what's in my bag. So the first item just on the top of my, near the top of my bag, I have uh, Revolutionary Road the novel. I read the, I um, watched the movie and I really liked it. It was nominated for an Oscar, starred Leo and, and Kate Winslet. Really, really great movie. Um, started reading the book. It feels very similar to the way the movie felt. Um, the pacing's a bit slow, so it's kind of hard to, to sit through it and read the whole thing at one time. And I always lose, um, I, I always lose my spot because I, um, I always lose my bookmark in my in my purse, which is kind of funny. And I've been reading it on and off for a little while now, and I really am enjoying it. Um, I also have a review of um, this novel. I'm sorry, I mean of the movie on my blog. So I know that was a really shameless plug, but I really enjoyed it. The book, I mean the movie. So now I'm trying to get um, finish the novel. So what else is in my bag? Um, my cell phone. I have the really skinny Nokia cell phone. I don't know what model it is, but um, it plays music too, but I haven't found a way to set up the software on my Mac yet because it's not compatible. So if you know how, send me a message. <laughs> and I really, I really like it because it's, um, there's great photo quality on it, you know, like the picture's nice and it's handy, but it's difficult to text on it because it is really skinny and small, but I like that it can carry to my clutch and stuff. So that's nice. Um, what else do I have in here? I have my headphones for my iPod. I have to find my iPod in here. Um, oh, I have sunglasses. I have my Ray-Ban sunglasses. I really like these. I have these in the men's model, and they're in the the um, classic black frame. So they're like the kind of the shiny finish one. I don't remember what model it's called, but it's the first edition when they first relaunched them, and they became back they came back in style. I got them then. <laughs> so then now they have the smaller framed ones that are a little bit narrower and a little bit taller. So um, they look a little bit different if you. Um, if you see, I really like them and I, and they're a little bit big on me. So I had to get them, uh, adjusted in the back and they steamed it up and they kind of helped me, um, make them a little bit smaller cause they are the men's version, but I like them and yeah, and it, it's a little bit different. So it's it not exactly the same as what everybody else has, but you know, <laughs> at least I tell myself that. So, um, I have my wallet in here. I got my wallet when I was on exchange in Taiwan, so it's like a really nice little like pouch. It's kind of more of a pouch than actually a wallet. So anyways, I have medicine here, nothing major. Um, some cash, all my cards, kind of a mess, which it makes it really difficult when I'm paying for stuff to grab everything, <laughs> but that's all right. Um, I have my health cards in the front pouch. Um, it's a nice little like soft leather. It's I think it's a Korean... A Korean leather product but it's actually been really great it, it's it's good quality considering I've, I've really beat it up you know and then um, it has a little change part pouch at the back so it carries everything and plus I like that I can switch this into a smaller bag and just pull it out and toss it in I don't I'm not a big fan of big wallets just because I find that I'd, I'd lose stuff so I like that everything's central and I can just move it from purse to purse and not worry that my big wallet won't fit um, what else do I have in here? I have this little Paul Frank clut, little purse thingy. I use it to kind of carry my lip glosses and lipsticks and stuff. But right now, um, since I left it unzipped <laughs> in my big purse, it's everything's fallen out. Um, I have this Lancome Juicy Tube sampler size one. I, I got a big set of them and I just toss in the sample sizes into different bags and stuff. 
Um, I was wearing Miracle, and it smells kind of like cotton candy, which is really nice. And it it comes in a it comes out more clear than anything with a light light tint with little glitter in it. I really like this color. I wear it all the time over lipstick and stuff, which is nice. And then I have minty tums in case I have a stomach ache from eating too much. Uh, I have band aids of different sizes. And that's what I have in here. I used to have more stuff in here, I think, but I wonder where my other stuff is. Okay, um, what else do I have? My keys. I know, it's kind of a funny um, keychain. I have my little whale keychain. My sister sent it to me when I was on exchange. We have nicknames, and she would always call me a, a whale. Don't ask. But uh, then I have my house keys, um, a key, key for my lock. Um, Oh, and I got this little keychain as well in the mall this weekend. My friend and I were being silly, and we decided to put a dollar into those, like, little vending machine thingies. And then we both got one of these ugly cartoon poop things. It's pretty ugly, I'm not going to lie, but it's funny enough. Um, what else do I have in here? Oh, more lipsticks. Um, I have uh, this one in Biotherm SPF Lip Gloss. It's a really natural pink color. I wear it every day if I'm, and it, it's really moisturizing, so it works, it's glossy, and it's also um, kind of a lip balm as well. It's color 140, very pretty color. That usually goes in here. <laughs> and then um, I have this one, the Bath & Body Works Mentha Lip Glosses. Um, this is my go-to lip gloss for sure. It's in pink mint, but I was peeling off the label when I got really antsy waiting in line somewhere and I just started ripping the label and then now it's labelless. It's naked now. So don't look. And uh, I have more Bath and Body Works stuff. I have the Bath and Body Works warm vanilla sugar antibacterial stuff. It smells really nice, but my friends get so annoyed that it smells more overpowering than their food when I'm eating out and I use it. <laughs> but I like it and and Sometimes I, I'm more considerate and use it earlier, so before the food comes. <laughs> um, I found my iPod. It's in a nice leather Belkin uh, case, so it gets destroyed in my purse, and it's still, it's still um, unscratched. I have an iPod Touch. Yeah, there it is. And I have my gym keys. I have a little, like, lock and stuff on it. I have... A pack of extra gum. I mean, Excel gum. I have... Oh! Uh, oil absorbing sheets. These are really, really useful during the day. I don't like to touch up with powder, and I don't carry a powder with me, because they always get crushed, and, and, and the powder will always break in my purse. So then this one I just carry around for mid-afternoon shinies. And I got these from Sephora. So they're really nice, and they're like... I think they're, they're all organic or... or um, natural so they're just rice paper sheets you can see them here I also have more lipsticks I have the Revlon lip gloss in Shine City this one I always have I always have like a couple of these lying around everywhere I got them when they were on sale I think at shoppers or something I have like three of these around my room <laughs> really great color it mixes with everything comes out clear but with, with a little glitter nice natural color um, I have one of my favorite lipsticks, Hug Me by MAC in my purse too. Look how crushed it got. It's really sad. I'll need a new one. Ugh. But I'm wearing it right now. It's really, it's a pretty color. And I have uh, Dr. Scholl's for her tapes. It goes on your shoe. Like you roll it out and then you cut the tape on the top and then you put it into your shoe if, if you're, in case there's cuts and stuff. And I always wore heels for a long time, so... I have these on hand as well. And I have a coupon for razors. And that looks like it. <laughs> wow. And that's what's in my bag. So let me know what you guys have in yours. And um, am I kind of silly for having about six lip products in my bag? Maybe. Um, but just let me know what you guys think. And uh, I can't wait to hear what you guys have in your bag too. Okay, see ya.